Hi, my name is Elena Ewens, and I'm a teaching artist with Mural Arts Philadelphia. Today, we're going to learn about emphasis and create some art inspired by our favorite album covers. This lesson is inspired by Dreams, Destiny, and Diaspora, a mural made in 2018 through a collaboration with Joshua Mays and DJ King Britt. This mural integrates art and technology through image recognition and the sounds of an original score based on community interviews and youth created sounds. By the end of this video, you should have an understanding of emphasis as well as a funky new piece of art. So let's talk about emphasis. Emphasis is creating a focal point in a composition to draw attention towards a particular area. This can be done through pattern, thickness, color, value, direction, or scale. In Dreams, Destiny, and Diaspora, Joshua Mays uses color and value to bring emphasis to the light the young woman is holding in her hand. We can see that the brightest colors and values are used in concentric circles around her fingers, while the darker colors and values are used the further away we get from the light. Now, with a mild grasp of the concept, let's move on to the activity. For this project, you will need a picture of your favorite album cover, paper cut into a square, pencils, a sharpener, an eraser, and any coloring materials you may be comfortable with, including colored pencils, markers, pastels, watercolors, whatever you may like. Now that you've chosen your album cover, let's take a closer look at it. What other elements and principles do you recognize? How does it demonstrate emphasis? Remember, emphasis can be achieved through pattern, thickness, color, value, direction, or scale. Also, what will be the theme for your work of art? For this exercise, I've chosen Paramore's Riot album cover. Right off the bat, you can see that the focal point of this image is the name of the album, Riot. Emphasis is achieved through scale, with the size of the title being five times as big as the rest of the text in the image. It's also achieved through color, with only the title being written in bright orange. With our types of emphasis identified, we can use these as inspiration for our piece of art. I'm now going to do a piece that uses scale and color for emphasis. Your art piece may be using pattern, thickness, value, or direction as well, depending on the album cover you've chosen as your inspiration. And with that, we have our finished piece of art. Pat yourself on the back. That looks gorgeous. You can also use this method to inspire other works of art too. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. See you next time.